Finding Parts Mental Subtraction by Counting Up or Down Whether it's four eggs from twelve or gravity's head from his whole self. Whole minus part equals part. Say, I'll take myself apart to help you learn math. One simple way people subtract is to start with a whole and count back to take away what we're subtracting. Fingers can help. So if I wanted to know what 12 minus 4 was, 11, 10, 9, 8. 12 minus 4 equals 8. One more time, for 12 minus 4, I back up 4 from 12. 11, 10, 9, 8. We can also count forward from the part we know. So if we're taking away 8, that would take a lot longer to count down. We can start with the 8, then see how many times you count forward to get to 12. So we already have 8. Fingers help. 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 minus 8 is 4. We can think about the amounts on a number line too. Whether it's eggs or miles or ideas, if the whole is 12 and one part is 8, 12 minus 8 equals 4. 12 minus 4 equals 8. Take away one part, the other part's left. We can put parts together to make the whole. 8 plus 4 equals 12. 4 plus 8 equals 12. This works for bigger numbers too. You could subtract 100 minus 1 by regrouping like this. That seems like a lot of writing. Or we could count back, like mile markers on the road. 100 minus 1 equals 99. You don't have to see all of the first 99 to know they're there. Move backwards 1 to subtract 1. Your turn. Time to pause. Write these answers down, then go to the answers on the next slide. Do you notice any patterns? Let's get a little harder. 92 minus 3. Be sure to move and change when you start counting. 92 is the whole. Count back. 91, 90, 89. 92 minus 3 equals 89. 89 is a part. 3 is a part. 92 is a whole. 92 minus 3 and 89, two ways of describing the exact same amount. Now let's look at that same relationship with a different twist. What if we know the big part? 92 minus 89. They seem pretty close, right? Counting back 89 does not sound like a good idea, but we can also count forward and find the part we still need. We still have to move with the first count. We say 90, 91, 92. 91 minus 3 equals 92. Hey, that's 3. Some more practice. Pause, jot down the answers, then click to the next slide to see them. Here they are. Practice these kind of things in your head next time you're waiting for something. Always keep learning. The legal stuff.